What's up, guys, and welcome to the 36th episode of Ripping and Tearing Packs. If you're new to this channel, this is a twice-a-week soccer unboxing channel where we go ahead and open up cereal boxes, blaster boxes, hobby boxes, you know, and finds that we get at local card shows and, and items that we find on eBay and whatnot. So if you like this content and you want to see more, I ask you to do a few things. Make sure you subscribe on YouTube so you don't miss out on any of the further episodes I release, and also like the video because apparently that helps the algorithm. For today's episode, we've got a cereal box from the 2021-2022 EPL season, a blaster box here from our Road to the World Cup from Mosaic, and about six different finds that we have on eBay and whatnot. And again, I have no idea what I'm unboxing. Um, your guess is as good as mine because I've got about 40 or 50 different packages that I've got laying here in a corner that I need to get caught up on. As always, our first package that we unbox is our cereal box here from the EPL 2021-2022 season. And for those of you who have watched a few videos, you know that I look for a few different things. Right here off the top, I love Burnley Clarets. I'm a Burnley Claret guy, so when I get a Dwight McNeil, I get happy. We're looking for on our red and blue pulsars and silver prisms there or silver inserts on the back. We are looking for either Burnley Clarets or we are looking for Cristiano Ronaldo. That's what we're looking for. Ooh, Martinelli there, rookie card. James Madison. Josh Brownhill. Okay. Let's see, we got, ooh, Rashi. Okay. Sadio Mane. Oh, Jaden Sancho. The rumor is he is as good as gone. He's going to be transferred here this winter transfer window. So, Jaden Sancho. A red pulsar of Ruben Diaz. Okay. And Ashley Barnes on the color match. The blue pulsar, Ashley Barnes, a club legend. Let's go, man. That is a nice unboxing here, a nice cereal box. I forgot to mention, um, if you like some of the cards that I unbox, there's a high likelihood that you may see those on my eBay or whatnot store there because that's usually where I sell excess cards. And sometimes I get duplicates or sometimes I got to move some cards out to purchase some new ones. But the best way to see if you like any of these cards, the best way to purchase them is on the eBay or whatnot store, which I'll link in the description below. Now, for these blaster boxes, we're looking for one thing. We're just looking for one autograph card. We're on episode 36. So, you know, the odds of us finally packing an autograph card out of one of these blaster boxes, I feel like they're just continuing to grow. But we still have yet to unbox one auto. Let's see what we've got here. Our orange fluorescent of Marcus Lopez. No idea who that is. Griezmann, De Bruyne. Okay. Ooh, a Serginho Dest. United States men's national team. Eden Hazard on the top. Another Serginho Dest. And Joachim Anderson there from Denmark. Ruben Diaz, Alexi Sanchez, Ansu Fadi. Oh, Kai Havertz here. Not a bad Kai Havertz there, it looks like, on the hyper. Um, but hey, it looks like we are probably going to have another blaster box with no autograph card. Episode 36, and all we're shooting for is one auto. In case you guys are wondering how tough it is to pack an auto, pretty tough out of a blaster box here. Look at this Tiago, will to win on the insert. That's nice. That's a really nice will to win there by Tiago. I'll be honest, this package feels thicker than the others. Maybe it's got an extra card or so, but it is much thicker. Hold on. Look, look hold on. Look at this. <laughs> look at how many of these inserts that we got on this one package. <laughs> First off, Dooku's pretty good there for City. We've got Lucas Hernandez. We've got some Aussie International. We've got some fella from Poland. And our silver on the back. Four inserts on one package. I really had a little bit of a sliver of hope. I was like, holy shit, this package is much thicker, this pack, than the other ones. This could finally be our autograph card. Nope, just four inserts. <laughs> but, you know... I don't know. Not not really much to complain about. You know, I got myself a little Ashley Barnes card there on the blue pulsar, so I'm not complaining. 
And now we're going to start jumping into some of these eBay and whatnot finds here. Oh, baby. Oh, my God. Look at how sexy that is by Hamas Rodriguez. Nine mint from Select 2016. Eight of ten. Holy shit. Player worn material as well. Look at this. Hamas Rodriguez. And the Colombian kid as well. Who with the captain's armband. Hamas. Eight of ten. I love it. Two colors. Holy shit. Oh my god, looky here, guys. Look at this beautiful Franco Baresi card here. Holy shit, guys. Man, oh man, that is a nice one from 95, 96. Those old Italian League, those old Serie A cards really just pop. Oh man, Franco Baresi. Look at that. Oh, it's beautiful. Beautiful. Nine mint. Look at this 06 World Cup Kaka card. This is one of the first items I started the PC, the 06 World Cup. Now, I've got a few of the Kaka cards, 9 mint. But hey, if I see it at a good price, I like the cards. I like that World Cup. I like it. I mean, like, think about how many real stars and superstars had their rookie World Cup debut in that 06 World Cup. Messi, Ronaldo, Zlatan, the list goes on and on. And I mean, you've got here a Kaká, nine mint, and those foil cards just look so nice. Oh, buddy, nine mint Kaká from 06. Oh, that's another beaut. <laughs> Speaking of the 06 World Cup, who does it love a little Zidane Zidane, a little Zazu? I'm telling you, just look at how beautiful that 06 World Cup card is. They've got, it's like the foil and it's got the, it's got the country and the nationality behind it too. It had Brazil there for Kaká. And on the background here, you've got France just implanted or stamped on the card all over the place. And that nice Zidane Zidane card, nine mint. I love that 06. So this goes right to the PC. Oh, oh my God, look at this. Holy shit, guys. Oh my God, that's a beaut. Oh my goodness, guys. David Beckham, 10 gem mint. Holy shit. 14 of 15. David Beckham, 10 gem mint on the auto. 14 of 15. Let's freaking go. Oh my God. God. Damn, that's a beautiful card. Just completely sexy. Good gracious, guys. Look at this. From the 2014 Panini Prism World Cup. This is a huge PC item for me. I think this is the first auto that we've added from that set, too. Of Roberto Carlos. Holy shit, nine mint. And look at this. Gareth Bale. Right behind it there, a 9 mint from Panini. This is the Select Series out of 2016. This is 16 of 25. Guys, you know what? I decided let's just add one more package here into this unboxing. I mean, we've had some pretty great luck so far. I'm hoping it continues. Let's see what we've got. <sighs> oh, my God. Look at that shit. I gotta be super careful getting this next card out because... It splattered a whole bunch of whatever the hell this is to insulate the card. Oh, baby. Look at this super short print of Kylian Mbappe. Nine mint. Oh, baby. That's a nice short print or super short print. Guys, what another fantastic unboxing in the books. I know we didn't get our autograph card from our blaster box. But look what we unboxed here from our eBay and whatnot finds. You've got both from the 2006 World Cup, Kaká and Zidane Zidane, both nine mint. You've got here from the 1995-96 Calcio A, Syria A, nine mint of Franco Baresi. And from this 2016 select edition, you've got here from Hamas Rodriguez, a nine mint, two color, a player worn jersey card. That's a nice, sexy looking card. And also from that same set, you've got Gareth Bale. Out of 25, you've got here player-worn jersey and auto, nine mint. 
Look at this. We'll go ahead and look at this. Killian Mbappe, the super short print. That's a nice looking card. And how could you forget about this sexy beast here? David Beckham, 10 gem mint here. Out of 15, holy crap. What an amazing piece to add to the collection. And right to the PC here, you've got Roberto Carlos, 9 mint on that 2014 Panini Prism World Cup. Again, the first the first Panini Prism World Cup cards they'd released were from 2014. So that's why I always collect this series. It's the first. So it's a sexy looking set. It's a sexy card. I'm happy. I'm pumped. What another great unboxing of books. And always, guys, if you like this content and you want to see more, make sure to subscribe on YouTube and to like the video. Thanks so much, guys, for stopping by, and we'll see you real soon.